77, which makes it opposite airplane. And he has a big smile on his face, I guarantee you. He loves coming here. He said he was at Oshkosh and had a lot of people coming to Oshkosh, asking him about the airplane. And he said, well, you can tell a lot of people that were there. That Welcome back everybody to another episode. Today is going to be awesome. If you guys are new to the channel, Jake Dalton Olympic gymnast, now do a lot of fun things and today we're taking you on another cool trip. So please subscribe, check it out, and it's clear skies which is perfect for today's video. We are going to the Reno Air Races. It's going to be sick. Let's go. of those being the C model like him is flying here today. As a matter of fact, this particular aircraft is serial number CJ-177, which makes it one of the very last F-33Cs ever produced. Aircraft is equipped with a stock 300 horsepower Continental IO-550 engine that is turning a Hartzell three-bladed super scimitar propeller and is also equipped with state-of-the-art avionics provided by Aspen. This is pretty cool. So this plane right here is the one I flew in. He's getting ready to do a show in like 30 minutes. Eric, he's so awesome. That's the plane we got to fly around in. It was sick. If you listen closely, you may be able to hear the wind whistling through the struts, the gear, the flight controls of this 1941 J3 Cup. Let's listen. If you look closely, you can see that propeller is not moving. Look at this. He did it from 6,000 feet. He turned that airplane into a glider. Look at him crabbing into the wind. Get that wing down, gets it right onto taxiway Alpha 2. He rolls it in, he keeps an eye out for Mike Tyson, his buddy, right like that, my friends, with this wind and the conditions we have here today. He did it, Eric Tucker. You are the man! Opposite airplane, and he has a big smile on his face, I guarantee you. He loves coming here. He said he was at Oshkosh, and had a lot of people coming to Oshkosh, asking about the airplane, and he said, well, you can tell a lot of people that were there, they're, they like airplanes. Ask about the airplane, and they're very specific on the questions. These are airplane people that are here at Reno. This machine you see here can do competition aerobatics right up to the unlimited level. Freestyle aerobatics, formation training, and upset recovery training. It's great for sport aerobatics. It is precise, it is predictable, even at slow speeds. It has bicycle spin and, and uh, spin recovery characteristics. Crisp aileron handling through the entire uh, range of speed. 
it'll it'll roll at 380 degrees a second. I have no idea. I have no idea how you tell me. Alrighty guys, so it got so windy they actually had to cancel some of the races because it was too windy for the pilots. Uh, we got to check out a pylon. We were supposed to watch one of the races from the pylon, but it got canceled. And it was really hard to actually vlog while we were there and talk because of the wind. So I wasn't able to do much, but we got some really great footage. We're back home. I was uh, getting in the car, leaving the air races. Back home. Luca is here. She actually joined me at the air races with Kayla for a little bit. Um, was just trying to get some of the footage there, so I didn't get any of her. <laughs> you want to say hi? Say hi. <laughs> crazy. She absolutely had a blast, though, with all the people and all the planes. She really loved it. We got her these cool little headphones which are right here that she got to wear so those were perfect and she actually didn't mind them at all but what an awesome time and big big shout thank out <laughs> thank you Luca big shout out to the Reno Air Races for bringing us out they gave us this cool like goodie bag with our name on it and everything and it had a bunch of goodies in there this including my new t-shirt and then even like they printed this off for us which is Super awesome, so really uh, big shout out to you guys. Thank you so much to the Reno Air Races for bringing us out and putting on such a great show. The family and I had a great time. Uh, yeah, it was super fun. <laughs> As you can tell, she's still hyped up about it. So thank you so much, Reno Air Races. All right, guys, so that is going to do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you guys haven't been to the Reno Air Races and you live in this area, you definitely have to go next year. It is just a blast and they you get to see a ton of cool stuff and they have the displays of the military planes and everything. It's just really, really awesome. So thank you again. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you smash the thumbs up button. Subscribe if you are not, please guys. We want to do a lot of cool videos with you guys and the more of you out there subscribed and liking the videos, the better the videos do and the more we can get out there and do. So thank you guys. We'll see you in the next one.